why are you being like this? Is this is how y'all really are? Please stop. Uh, this Get is out. all on tape. Please stop. Get out of the car. Please don't hurt me. Why Get do you do this? No, sir. I'm telling you, get out. I'm, I'm telling you that this is not lawful. Yes, yeah, sir. Back with another one. Man, we got a, we got another crazy one, man. Another crazy one. I'm going to go ahead and dive into it. But before I dive into it, make sure you like, man. Make sure you comment, man. Make sure you subscribe, man. And make sure you like, comment, subscribe, man. Hit that notification bell, too, now. Hit that notification bell. So you get the video when they drop. You get that drop when they drop. So we can run it up. Let's run it up. What's going on, man? Hey, how you doing? Pretty good. I'm Officer Driscoll College Up Police Department. Reading the socks whenever you're coming down uh, Talent Road, I got you at 49 and 35. You sure? Yes, sir. Do what? I was asking you, are you sure about that because I was going below that. So what I got you at was 49. You got your uh, driver's license, your insurance card, and your registration on you? Do you have proof that you got me going after? I got you by radar, man. And I'm, am I allowed to see? Cause no, we're not, do, we're not doing that right now. You if mean? you want to argue all that, you have to go to court for it. Um, I'm saying that I wasn't going that way. But I'm saying that you are. So I need your information, please. Why is it that I can't see proof? Because it's bro, in my car. Bro, just get information up, bro. I don't have to get in the car to see it. I need your information. Could you get your supervisor so that we can have Give proof? me your information or you're going to be coming out of this vehicle. I can get out, sir, but... Can Give I me your information. I'm going to turn my video on. Get out, get out of the car. You can't do that for a traffic stop, sir. 623, start me now. Get out of the car, man. Please don't touch me, sir. I'm telling you to get out of the car. All right, well, let me turn my video on. I'm going to taste you. Get, you uh, get the hell out of the car. Sir, this is a traffic stop. Please don't hurt me, sir. I'm, I'm, I'm a good kid. Stop. Get out of the vehicle. I'm recording you. This is a traffic I'm stop. I will taste you. This get out. Traffic stop. Get out. You will be tight. Get out. He said he pulled me over for a traffic Get stop. Get out. To taste me. You can't do that, officer, because I call for your Get out. I have Get out. What is the you reason? You refuse to give you information. I told you I to get out of the car. I now you're resisting. I get to out. Refuse. I asked to speak to your supervisor. Get out. Sir, I get out. Please get your supervisor. I don't give a shit what you feel like. Me. I said get out. Please stop it. Why are you being like this? Is this is how y'all really are? Please stop. Uh, this get is out. all on tape. Please stop. Get out of the car. Please don't hurt me. Why get do you out. do this? No, sir. I'm telling you, get out. I'm, I'm telling you that this is not lawful. Ah. Oh my God. Get out. Lawful. Get out. That's not lawful. Get out. Get on the ground. That's not lawful. Get on the ground. You should have just gave that ID okay, up, bro. I have my life. Get on the ground. I mean, ground. give it up, bro. That's not lawful. Get on the ground. That was not a lawful Get stop. on the ground! Please help! Get on the ground! Please help! Get on the ground! I'm on the ground, but that's not lawful, sir. I have my license on. Put your hands behind your back! Please stop! Help! Please! Please help me! Please help me, Lord! This is not right, <laughs> sir! You I were just singing like, like you was in the choir when the tasers hit you. That's not right, sir. I have my license in my hand. Stand up. Please help. I can get up, sir. But you don't have to do all this. Why? Why do you have to do this? I just don't understand. I'm a real good person. I'm delivering a door dash that goes right there. That's why you should have just listened and gave him the ID so you could have heard it up. You're right, it was necessary. No, it wasn't, sir. I told you to give me information, you refused to comply. I didn't refuse. Yes, I, you did. I, no, I asked a question. I am allowed to ask you. I need help. <laughs> Good, thank you, sir. That wasn't right. That was not right, sir. What he gonna do with the cuffs on? I'll just wait here to I'm, help I'm get here. I'm good. I'm man, good. cuffed up, man. You can't pull me out of a traffic stop, sir. This old son, what he gonna I do? I never refused. That wasn't right. I have no radio signal. Let them know. Taser deployed and warning custody. Who that is? You're doing a ride along or something?
I'm gonna be like a finna be in training or something. Cause they don't like she had no badge or nothing. Why she ain't jump out of help? What's so wrong? Like what happened to you today? That wasn't right. I'm not gonna sit here and argue with you. I, no I told you to give me your information. I you didn't want to comply. Then I tell you get out of the car, to, I and then you don't want to get out of the car. I have my license in my hand. They should be sending somebody. I asked, I asked for the supervisor, ma'am. And you you taste me because I asked for you. Because you refused to comply, then we're resisting arrest. Scary. I asked for your information. You're scary. You put I'm me not arguing. The car. I asked for help. My information was in my hand. And you were refusing to give it. I did not refuse. Yes, you I did. I asked for your supervisor. I asked for your supervisor. Why am I not allowed to ask that? Because we're not doing that. When I give you a lawful order, you have to follow it. You have to uh, abide by what my request. I didn't. I do not have to abide by your request. It's a request. I don't feel comfortable. We're in the middle of stop, and I'm telling you, we're give me information. In the middle of the road. This is where you stopped. I could have kept going, but I don't know where to stop. I was so wrong, and you tased me. I've never got in trouble. I've never thank you been, for stopping. I've never done nothing. Uh, thank you. That was so wrong, sir. I've Man, never, been, barely move never been treated you like this. Like you gonna stay there to help get stuff. I'm delivering a DoorDash, and I was not speeding. Get in your truck and go, man. But you used to be a police or something? People need to mind their business. You're fine, sir. I was wrong. What's the problem? Uh, I, he pulled me over for a traffic stop. I asked, could I see the... <laughs> The speed he knew he ain't finna help him. He, he said, no, I'm, I'm not allowed okay, to let you in my car. I said, that's fine. I don't feel comfortable, man. I have a super. You're making us look he bad. Me, he pulled my, hey, first thing, he my door without my consent, pulled me out of my car, tased me while I'm in the car, and said I'm I'm not abiding by his, his request. I have my license in my hand. It's just funny because he thought just because he seen the black officer pull up that he was going to be on his side. I ain't going to say because I don't know what he really thinking, but by his demeanor, he don't look like he finna take your side, my boy. He bent down like, you should, so you ain't listen to what they said, which you didn't. You should have just gave him the ID. You want to be talking back and jump, bro. Just give him the ID. He ain't even asked you to get out the car at first. It could have been that simple. I just asked for a supervisor and he got upset. That's not, that wasn't What right the supervisor to was going to say, the same like thing. You didn't have to yank me, yank me on the ground, or take you. Didn't you didn't have, have to, to not follow the orders. I didn't did not follow your orders. I asked to speak for a supervisor. Because While you I wanted to see the radar. Because I didn't feel comfortable. We stopped on the middle of the road, and no, I didn't feel. Were I you speeding? No, sir, I wasn't. That's why I told him. I, I don't believe I was speeding. Well, now you got bigger problems. And that's not a problem. That's where, where did you take? That was, I was uh, incorrectly. That's it was on that side. All his hope just was gone when he said that. He takes me while I'm in my car for a traffic stop. You can't do that. You can't pull One, me two, out. Three, so four, you five, can't treat me like seven, that. I asked for your supervisor and you seven went crazy. Officers. Like that wasn't fair to me. He come up smiling. Y'all go do some work, man. That man is stop. He can't go nowhere. He can't go nowhere. He cuffed. Y'all go do some other work, man. I'm pretty sure there's other people out there y'all be getting. Wasting tax dollars. Going probe in the side. I don't see the other one. Are any of you all his supervisor? Yes, sir, we are. We'll talk to you here in just a minute. Well, let's get this thing cleared up. They're not going to help you, bro. People always call for a supervisor and they don't do anything. They got to agree with their people. You never had to do a taste. I'm a good person. A good person that don't listen. You made it hard for yourself, my boy. Just drop the easy way or the hard way. And you chose the hard way. I'm on my way to do a door back there that's a half a mile up. I'm not running. 
<clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, as far as what I was right, talking about. Hold on, hold on. Before you, before you start, you have the right to remain silent. You can say cannabis and you can go to law. You have the right to an attorney. You can't afford one won't be appointed for you. You understand those rights? Yeah. You want to continue to talk to us? I'm not under arrest. You're not. That's how you know your rights. Okay? You're definitely you under arrest, my boy. I would like to arrest. to pull me out of my car. I did not deny any request. I I had a request. I asked to speak to the supervisor. That's specifically all I asked and that's all I wanted. So you asked for a supervisor? Be able to request that, and and that be it. I speak with the supervisor for whatever circumstances the supervisor says I can understand. Hmm. What was going on? So I saw him for forty nine thirty five. Kept asking for his information. Well, I want to see your record. Well, I'm not seeing that. If you want to do all that? You can go to court. I want. To, I'm no. You you don't you didn't stop me. Da 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 da. And so I tell him to get out of the vehicle. No, I'm not. I'm not getting out of my car. So, okay. And he's like, I want to see your supervisor when I grab hold of him. And so I got gave him multiple times to get out of the car. Wouldn't do it. This is even after going hands on. Well, I tased him, gave him multiple, multiple warnings. You're going to be tased, you don't get out of the car. Or he still won't get out of the car, so <clears throat> that's when I popped him. Did he fall and he fall and hit his hit his head or nothing like that? No, he was okay. he was still in the seat whenever he got tased. Just did you check him just for the taser deployment? I just kept trying to get him out hands on and he, he wouldn't get out and transition the taser. And I told him, you got a car, you're gonna be tased. It's multiple times when he still didn't get out, popped it. And that's when he finally started complying. Yes, ma'am. Yes. No, I heard that. No, just skinned up. Uh, uh, 4935. <clears throat> he was refusing to follow any commands, refused to give, give his information, refused to get out of the car. And so. Uh, there was some old man who stopped. I, don't, I didn't get his name. I got no one in the car. Do what? You good? My knee messed up, but it's fine. Well, do what? You ain't stabbed, so that's good. Oh, <laughs> Lord, I say never cut part. I get out of my mouth. All right. So. <laughs> Kicking the dash. I'm like, so you're here and they check him out. Take him out. We'll take him out. Oh man, huh, you you definitely ain't gonna get that tip from that door dash delivery because they ain't gonna never get their food unless the police officer nice enough to go still deliver their food. If you know you got all this going on, bro. You know you can't fight the ticket right there at the traffic stop. How about you just, you know, give the ID, you know, get the ticket, go to court. Hey, I didn't, I wasn't speeding. Let me see some proof. Let me see some proof. It's that simple, bro. Now you got to be dealing with all type of other problems because you were resisting. Then you end up getting tased. Like that could have been avoided. 
that could have been avoided. That's why I say it's like, you know, I used to be that person that used to be like, man, police always mess with me, which they do. They be messing with people. You know, they'll target a certain group or whatever, but still it's like, do I want to make this easy or do I want to make this hard? Because it's going to happen. So it's like, do I want to give them all the control where they can end up getting me all hyped up to where I'm doing something to give them the the proper cause to be able to put their hands on me? Or do I want to just, here go my ID, here go my ID, I mean my driver license, sir. I ain't even got to say, sir, here go my driver license. Nothing else, I ain't really got to do no talking to them. We ain't friends or nothing. I don't know, people need to think about that, like, it's either going to jail or going home. Now you paying all type of other money, court costs and all that just for nothing, man. And spending time in jail. If you never been in trouble, why would you want to go to jail for something stupid like that? Till next time. Yes, sir.